Okay, so we got a fairly easy question right here. The question says a neutron can decay to produce a proton. Which of the following equation correctly shows neutron decay? So we can do this question either by charge to confirm it, we can use lepton to confirm it, or we can use Brion number to confirm it. It's completely up to you. I'm gonna use charge, so let's see option number A. The charge of neutron is basically zero the charge of proton is basically one the charge of electron positive is basically positive one charge and uh, for anti electron neutrino is basically zero so this is incorrect as this is zero and this total is two so we have to cross this out as so let's go for option number b we have neutron which is zero we have proton which is one we have electron which is one as well electron positive and then we have electron neutrino which is zero so we have to cross this out as well because over here we have zero and over here we have two so we cross this out let's go for option number c we have neutron which is zero we have proton which have one we have electron which is this time negative so it's negative one and then we have anti-electron neutrino which is basically zero so this is correct let's check for the next option as well for confirmation so neutron which is zero proton which is one and electron with a negative sign we have negative one and then electron neutrino which is basically zero this is also correct so now we have to do the lepton number to find out either c or d is correct so let's do from the lepton number so neutron we have for lepton number is basically zero we have for proton is basically zero we have an electron which is negative so we have the lepton number for it which is one and for anti electron neutrino which is we have negative one sign so the overall it is zero zero over here and zero over here so this is correct so let's check the option d so we have neutrino uh, uh, neutron which is basically zero and then we have proton which is basically zero as well and then we have electron which is positive one and then we have electron neutrino which is positive one as well so as we know this is incorrect because over here we have zero and over here we have positive two so this is incorrect so our final option will be c